Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. My name is Vishal. In this tutorial, I will guide you how to insert image and QR code with the help of print merge in CorelDRAW. So let's begin with print merge. So to start with, go to file menu and inside file you will find print merge and the very first option is create slash load print merge. When you click on it, you will find a small dialog box something like this. In this you have to import the file which you have already uh, prepared for print merge. So we need to click on import data source. So before importing a file I would like to show you how the file looks like. Let me just cancel this. Minimize Corel Draw. And now this is the file. The file extension is .csv. When you double click and open the file. So the file looks something like this in which we have multiple entries like name, email address, contact number, name of company, designation and photographs. So the photo which is there in my local drive, I have just paste the path over here. So this file has total of nine entries. Let me close this file without saving it. Now coming back to CorelDRAW. I'll go to file again, print merge, create and load print merge. Now I have to select the file which I've just shown you, import data source. The file is on desktop, print merge with pictures, open the file. Now as you can see the same columns and rows are displayed over here which I've shown you in the file. Now you can manually add or delete the entries from here. For example, if I want to add any uh, entries, just click on the small plus sign, add a record. Now manually, I can add entry over here. Now as you can see, I have manually add the entry and just in case if you want to delete any entry you can just select the entry and just click on the minus sign over here which says delete a record i am deleting one record over here now once you have made the changes just click on the continue option now the changes has been loaded now if you can see a small window will appear like this which says print merge window now we have to define which field you want to insert so i want to insert name insert field as you can see the name has been inserted over here and now to insert a second entry I have to first deselect this and then select the entry from here I will go for designation insert field now both the fields has been inserted if you want to copy the same attributes from the existing file you can use the attribute eyedropper tool copy the attribute and you can use to paste on your existing one now manually I don't want this I'm going to put it somewhere over here I can define and make the changes over here if you want to make it alignment just you can check the alignment whatever is required for you now in this way I have added two entries name and designation now I'm going to insert QR code for this. I will go back to the print merge and deselect the QR code. Now for which entry I want to make a QR code, I'll define that. I want to make QR code for the contact number. And now I'll just click on the insert field. When I click on the insert field, it will create a QR code and it will show you like this. Now you can very easily resize according to your requirement and you can place it where you want to place it. Now we are done with name, designation, QR code. Now I want to insert the profile photo. Now for the photo also, we'll repeat the same thing. Now for image, go to image. You have to define what is the data source. It is photo. And over here in the placeholder image, you need to select any individual photo from the group. It can be any image. Now it will just place the path over here. Now the path is also done. Now you, you, have, you have just need to click on insert field. Now before inserting, I will first create one ellipse. 
and now I'll go to insert field. Now manually I will drag the image. Now the image is appear over here. I will put this image in this ellipse. I will power clip inside this. So right click release power clip inside. I will use the power clip option and I will make it fill proportionally. As you can see the image is uh, filled proportionally as per the shape. Now once this is done I still have the option to make the changes. I don't want this. I will remove. I will put this somewhere over here towards the left side and I will just resize this. Resize the shape. Fine. Once it is done for one entry, for the other entry, you just need to click on the create merge document. When you click on the create merge document, automatically it will take some time and start loading it. Now once the loading is done, as you can see, the page number one and the other entries are also over here. So we have got the images, we have got the QR code, name and the designation. At any point of time, if you want to make changes to any individual entry, you can just go to the individual entry, you can make changes and it is done. So it is completely and very easy to use. I hope the tutorial is really helpful for you. Thank you so much for watching. I have created the same tutorial in Hindi as well. So if you want to see the same tutorial in Hindi, you can just go to the channel and you can find the tutorial in Hindi as well. Thank you so much for watching.